back in 1811 by a surveyor seeking to map this remote region. No one believed what he reportedly saw. Due to the sheer remoteness of this region, his story was written off as the senile delusion of an old man, and his tale was forgotten. It was not until recently that the government was approached by a scientist named Andrew Fisher to use this location as an alternative energy project of some sort. How he came to discover this place is beyond me.
Pathfinders to grapple onto certain target points within a limited range, allowing them to reach areas where jumps prove insufficient. For testing purposes, the Viper coil is currently limited to particular targets.
regeneration policy in effect. I've often found myself in the company of a pathfinder named Edwin Hall. The things he can do in a leaf suit are astounding. Some nights we'll head to the rooftop above my office and watch the auroras. I have no idea what he could possibly see in me, though. I tend to ramble a lot. I mean, who wouldn't find Mesoamerican calendrical systems anything other than fascinating? Guys love that stuff, right? <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.